everybody today I have two unboxings this first one is from Columbia Candle Supply Company so let's take a look so here's what's inside my uh, Columbia candles um, besides this cute little tissue paper it has this warning it's so cute though really right <laughs> <laughs> this package contains glitter. Of course it does. The first item is Lush Linens. It smells like linens. Just liked the scent description on the site, which is why I purchased that one. Sea salt and flowers. This is called Ocean Water. Oh yes, this smells really nice. Um, very uh, summery. What the heck else do I have in here? Oh yeah, I purchased. Um, it was a package. Let's see if it has it in the box somewhere. Oh my gosh, how much stuff did I buy? This must. I have no clue. Um, all right, anyway, so I purchased this. I can't remember if it was called the uh, it's like a getaway theme, and it has a, a bunch of different um candles in there. So we'll get back to that one in a minute. But we have this big, beautiful rose. Um, and it's hibiscus palm. That smells like a memory. Huh? Um, this one here is citron and mandarin. That smells like orange. Look how pretty it is. I like the uh, glitter over top of it. What is that, a butterfly? It looks like flowers and a butterfly. Next one is called Stormwatch. Can't smell this one. Um, but I bought all of these based on the description. I don't remember that I ordered this much stuff, though. So some of these must be freebies. There's no invoice to refresh my memory right at this moment. All right. We had... I remember ordering this. I remember ordering this. <laughs> I remember ordering the rose. Um, all right, so what's in this other bag? I will open it up and let you know. Let me preface this whole thing by saying this bag, this bag. Let me preface this whole thing by saying this bag smells amazing. Like all the scents together. Ugh, it smells so good. All right, so. Oh my gosh, it really does. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, so this very first one is uh, as you're going on your summer adventures. This one's Monaco. As you can see, it's white tea, ginger, chestnut, birch, bergamot, rosewood. It smells nice and it's super glittery. Next one is um, headed to Bora Bora. And Pure Paradise is the name of the scent. Oh, that smells like... I don't know. That smells like... Gosh, memories are so tied to scents, aren't they? Uh, it smells like another memory, like maybe... Almost like a cologne somebody used to wear. All right. The next one, where are we going now? The Maldives, and it is um, sea glass, ocean water, geranium, ocean mist, and white cedar wood. For some reason I cannot smell this one, but they are super shimmery in there. Looks like we have some bark from Venice. Gazelle and fresh baked bread, sugar waffle cone. I love me a sugar waffle cone. All right, let's see. It smells super nice. 
Um, next we had, I'm sorry, we're going to Tahiti. This one is scented in white tea and berries, chestnut and exotic flowers, plus some birch. That smells super nice. That's one of the scents that I could smell coming straight out the bag. Look this thing. It is so cute. This is uh, us heading to the Bahamas. Fresh coconut, real, a real rum berry. I love that. And sparkling limeade. Delicious. The next one is called uh, Miami. And I can't read what it says. Guava, fizzy pop. I can't read it. Looks like it's been rubbed off a little bit somehow. Anyway, this is Miami. It's like a just a regular bar shape, very sparkly, and there's some kind of design on it. Oh, a, a feather, I almost said a leaf. Um, and then we have Dubai. I would love to go to Dubai. That smells awesome. Palo Santo. I can't read the next word. I can't read the next word. I can't read. It looks like it's kind of like. I can read the rosewood ginger peach. Maybe you guys can make it out. Maybe it's the. Uh, I can't read. I can't. I can't tell whether that's an H or an N or. Anyway, you guys can read. If hopefully you guys can see what's. I guess I would have to know what it is to know whether it's what it is actually. It won't even focus. All right. Anyway, so that's Dubai. The next one, we're headed to Honolulu. This is pink flamingo, coconut, mandarin, pineapple, hibiscus, and mango. I can see all of that crystal clearly. And this one has a starfish on it, and it smells amazing. Last stop, San Diego. This is sea salt and agave. Ocean water, flowers, and hints of blackberry sage. Another nautical theme. Super shimmery. And this smells like amazing. All right, so where did we travel? We traveled to San Diego, Honolulu, Miami, the Bahamas, Tahiti, Dubai, Venice, Bora Bora, the Maldives, and Monaco. All right, so that's all that I have for the first unboxing. Um, I'll be back with the next unboxing. This next unboxing is from Hocus Pocus Bath. Um, and I guess I will be back having had opened these. I'll be right back. All right, so what have we here from Hocus Pocus? The first one that we have is Cujo. And look at him. Don't be afraid. It's just a bath bomb. All right, so cute. Um, and then I only got four items, so this should be quick. Um, the next one is the Shelly bath bomb. And I just thought this was kind of cute. I don't know. I've seen them time and time again, but something about this being not painted up I liked all right and the next one look at this this is awesome I love it and it's called song of the witches bath bomb huh. I was just about to call it a cauldron look at that pretty oh is that a crack it'll still work the same I think it's just the plastic 
And then the last one that I got is Rocket Pop. And this is, um, this looks like a bar of soap that I got a couple years ago. Um, I don't know what it's scented in. Probably Rocket Pop scent. Le what's that? Lemon, blue raspberry, and cherry. And don't know this one. Cannot smell it through the wrapping. This one I could smell. This smelled super nice. And then finally, Song of the Witch's Bath Bomb. I really like this one. All right, guys, that's it for Hocus Pocus uh, bath and uh, for this unboxing. I don't know why I'm stuttering, but I am. Um, I will talk to you guys on the next one.